Hello everyone, myself Karan Rana, I am full stack developer, having a 3 year experience in development as well as a 4 stack coder on CodeForce and CodeChef. So today we are again discussing one of the another OA problem that is asked on the on campus in many various colleges in India and the company name is Essential which was asked on the 9th September 2024. So today in this session or in this video, we are discussing about problem that is based on the string and it will be a string manipulation problem. So let's see what is the problem is. So the problem is simple that we are given a two strings A and B and you need to require to determine the difference between the number of wide spaces in each string and based upon the parity of this difference. We need to return a specific string format. That means you are given a true string A and B and we need to find how many spaces between that string. After finding out the spaces between the two string, we need to differentiate the difference. After differentiation, we need to return the specific string format. So we have the inputs given two string A and B containing only printable ASCII characters. And what are the specific format that we have to output the string in the format that means if the difference we got after the counting of spaces and the absolute difference is even then we have to return even and what is the difference between them. Next if the difference is odd we need to print odd then after difference. And what are the details of the question so the details of the question that simple we need to count the number of wide spaces that including spaces, tabs, new lines, etc. in both these strings. Next, we need to calculate the absolute difference between these counts. And after that, we need to return the result as specified. So now let's see with an example, how can we do this problem? Let us understand this problem by using an example. So we have an example given string A equal to hello world and string B equal to hi there. So now let's count how many spaces bit are in the string A. So we have one spaces, we have two spaces. Now count the spaces in string B, we have one spaces only. So what is the difference? The A minus B space, that means two minus one. So the output we got, difference we got is one. So one is actually an odd number. So what we have to return? We need to return odd one because the difference is odd so we need to return the I have written the codes for you so that you can easily understand and it will not take time to write the code so let's see the things step by step so first we go to the main function in the main function i take an input to a string that is a string a string b i use the get line function to take the input of the first string and also the input for the second string. Now I will output the result by using the white space difference and under the white space difference function I pass string A and string B. Next go to the uh, white space function under that we are passing a string B and a string B that is both the string as a parameter now we need to count the spaces between them so for the string a we need to how to count the spaces we have declared a variable that is count a count is white spaces a and for the string b we have declare a variable that is count b that will count the spaces with b now let's go to the count spaces b function so what we have done in the count is white spaces b in the count space spaces function I make a function in which I pass the parameter that what is string that we need to pass either it should be a or b after that I use the algorithm and STL function that will return the count the number of spaces between them so what the STL function is that I've used I use the count if STL function that will start iterating from the beginning of the string to the end of a string and in that I pass a condition that it will each space it will count the spaces between them 
so actually what this count if function does it will count the number of spaces between the string from the beginning of the string to the end of a string with their spaces and it will return that in the count white spaces so what we have gone after we storing the white spaces of the count white spaces the count a similarly for the spaces for the string b we store that space in count b next we need to find the difference so how can we find our difference so we need to find our absolute difference so what we have used we use the absolute function that is abs under that i pass the count a minus count b it will give me the absolute difference and absolute white spaces difference between the string a and string b after we calculate the difference we need to check whether it's an even or odd so what actually we are given the problem we need to return if the difference is odd we need to return the odd and the difference if the difference is even we need to return even and the even difference so if the difference percent 2 by equal to equal to 0 here we are using the remainder operator that will check if a number is odd or even so it will return even after that we just converted that to that is the number value will be converted into string value by just two string function so what the two string function does two string function it will convert the integer to the num string value and it will concatenate concatenate with the even so what actually we are getting output we get the output even or that the string difference similarly for the odd in the else case we are got odd plus the two string function so that's actually the code we need to write for solving this problem and it will be easily and there is not a typical code first we need to count the spaces after that we need to find the difference then you have to check by even or odd checks now we have some test cases there so in the first case we have the input no spaces here and no spaces here so let's see blindly we have one space here one space here we have one space here we have one space here so for the string a we have two spaces for the string b we have two spaces so what is the difference difference will be zero we got two minus two will be zero and what we have got output we have got output even zero so let us run by this that actually the test case is passing or not so it will take time to run so the test case has been passed and it will take 82 milliseconds for running that case and we have got the output even zero next we have another input that is this is a test in this we have one space two space three space and four space another thing we have one space here and another two space here three space four space so how many spaces for for space in both so how many difference is zero so it will be a even zero next hello world in that we have one space and one space that is two space in string a and in the string b we have one space only so what will be expected of it that is two minus one that will be odd one now let's run this case let's see it's right or not Just wait for a second. So we have got it. Our test case has passed. It will take 244 milliseconds. And we have got the output, expected output at odd one. And we have received the output at odd one. So that's actually you can solve this problem that how to find out the white spaces between the two given string. And if you've done this problem by yourself, you are smarter enough in DSA and you can easily crack the essential OE.